Is it cruel or an act of compassion? Clark County may be getting ready to crack down on panhandling. So we sent Cor Harlan to get some answers about this plan, and he found out the sheriff's sergeant opposes it. He believes it will actually help the panhandlers. You know, on the face of it, discouraging people from giving money to homeless panhandlers seems like a mean idea. But one Clark County Sheriff's deputy I talked with today says that money panhandlers get enable them to live in conditions like this and avoid seeking the real treatment they need. And this is nothing. Really? This is nothing. Clark County Sheriff Sergeant Randon Walker leads me into an abandoned motel along Highway 99. It's an illness. To show me the temporary living arrangements made possible by the generosity of people who've given money to a panhandler. A panhandler that Sergeant Walker knows simply is James. This is what kind hearted, sweet, wonderful people are giving James. James isn't buying water. Right. James isn't buying chicken soup or Gatorade. James is buying steel reserve. Sergeant Walker wants James in treatment for his alcohol addiction. But what's getting in the way, he says, is the money he gets panhandling every day. His only source of funds for the steel reserve is, is out on the He's intersections, working, on the yeah. on-ramps, right? And failing that, uh, especially amongst our drug addicted, is theft. Thank you, brother. Have a good day. Sergeant Walker is helping write a Clark County anti panhandling ordinance. It would prevent panhandlers from stepping into off ramps and streets to take money from passing cars. It would also crack down on aggressive panhandling by making it illegal for someone to keep asking for money after they've been told no. If they do decide to give me a dollar or two, I thank them. This man is panhandling in a busy Vancouver off-ramp. He tells me he's struggled with alcohol addiction, has been in and out of treatment, and has been sober for several weeks. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. It's appreciated. Have a good day. He says he'll likely buy cigarettes with the money he's been offered here today and has no sympathy for aggressive panhandling. People that badger other people for money, panhandlers, they should be badgered. They should because they're bothering people. It is controversial, but Sergeant Walker says discouraging panhandling isn't mean. It is, he says, the compassionate act of trying to get alcohol and drug treatment for people who need it most. In Clark County, Cor Harlem, Coin 6 News.